Well, daytime is definitely celebrating Thanksgiving in our kitchen today. Mm -hmm. We are getting ready for the holiday. This is an annual tradition we have with Wanda, who comes out and just shows off. She really just shows off. I mean, <laughs> look at her showing off right here. I mean, all the way around here. And how many Thanksgiving dinners do you do for people? Well, last year we had 300, and I had to cut it off because I couldn't do no more. <laughs> you couldn't get another turkey in the oven, could you? Yeah. But that's not counting all wow. the little side dishes, you know, whether they just want sweet potatoes or cranberry salad. You know, we have to have time to make all those, too. I'm Dish. almost in a food coma just standing here, and I haven't touched a thing yet. Unlike too my late. partner over here who's dipping her finger in butter and eating rolls. Okay? It's on a roll. It's just... You want to know I cannot stay away from your homemade rolls. And I'll make sure. It, that's how you start everything, is from it's, scratch. It is. It is. Plus, we have more in the oven <laughs> for later. Wow. Okay. <laughs> So let's get started. Okay, every year we have a basic turkey dinner with the traditional things. You'll get either a whole turkey breast or a whole turkey. Mm. Did I, I didn't say it right. A turkey breast or a whole turkey. Either and then one. you we get the trimmings you right. Yeah. And if you want both, yeah. she can hook you up with both. I can hook you up yeah. with both. Yeah. Um, my traditional is with dressing and gravy, mm -hmm. mashed potatoes, green beans, and dinner rolls. That's and you, a traditional. <laughs> you brought some of the dressing that you yes. do. Mm -hmm. And you do a very traditional dressing. Yes. Mm -hmm. It's a cornbread dressing. And we make it from scratch, so it's not Pepperidge Farm. See. How how big is your bowl when you're getting those breadcrumbs well, and cornbread growing? It and takes a bunch. <laughs> See, that's the thing. I love cornbread stuff. Mm -hmm. I love it because, I, you know, other the people flavor. make it other ways, yeah, and it's okay, uh, but this yeah. is the best way to go. I mean, I'm old school, and people know me for there old school go. traditional <laughs> things. If it's not broke, don't fix it. That's don't exactly fix it. Right. So, and then let's go over here. Right. Got These your... are fresh uh, sweet potatoes. Mm. I peeled those this morning. Got the and little marshmallows mm -hmm. melted on And it. you don't have mm -hmm. to have marshmallows. I mean, I just like a plain old sweet potato myself, mm -hmm. but a lot of people like that little sweet mm -hmm. yeah. sweetness with it. And then you've got your Real regular mashed potatoes. potatoes. That's Real my mashed bowl. Where's potatoes. yours? <laughs> <laughs> Look at the butter. I know. And that's special butter. Oh, yeah. Yes, it is. I want green, um, green bean casserole. Right, green bean casserole. <laughs> I got my thing tied. There you are. But anyways, um, we do make anything that you can think of. And I tell people, whatever your imagination is on preparing the food, we can make it. Because sometimes they'll say, well, Wanda, what can you make? Well, <laughs> the sky's the limit. You just tell me what you want, and we can make it for right. you. Uh, easier than me trying to list it. And this is one of the fastest containers of macaroni and cheese. I mean, that goes fast, right? Isn't it? And that's one of your favorites, right? It's it is so good. Mm -hmm. It's so creamy. Everything is just mm -hmm. delicious. And sometimes people will substitute. Say, like we have green beans here, and maybe they can green beans, or they have their own way of making green beans, so they can substitute it, like for cream corn, or you know, mac and cheese, yeah. or you know, something different. And your cream corn is. The, the real deal. The real deal. Look right. at that. No can. No. Right. From there a can. you go. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, cans are not allowed in your kitchen. <laughs> they are, are they? not allowed She in will that call the Mayberry deputy and That's he will right. come over and, yeah. <laughs> Barney will have to get them out there. <laughs> Did you bring a can in? No All cans. Right. <laughs> and then gravy, our homemade gravy. And so what is this? This is for a substitute for right. folks that are doesn't want turkey, doesn't want ham, and I have some family members that doesn't care for either one. Right. That is a vegetarian lasagna. And wow. that's something new that I brought this year. And that looks really good, too. Because uh, a lot of people don't realize that we make uh, vegetarian or vegan dishes, you know, for those. Uh, we have sandwiches at the deli, right. too, but if they want that in the place of a turkey or ham. And one thing that people need to understand is that you will cut it off, and every year they say, oh, what do you mean I'm calling too late? Yeah. So if you know that you mm -hmm. want Miss Wanda here to do some of the cooking for your Thanksgiving, you need to go ahead and make that I call. I just want to stir you, okay. stir you corn here a little bit so it don't burn. We haven't even <laughs> talked about the ham and the turkey, mm -hmm. which is also in the oven, and we've got all these desserts to talk about, oh, too. Yeah. So we're going to take a break and tell more about what you can find at Whistle Stop coming Can't up wait. here a little later in the show. Thank oh, you, Miss Wanda. You. Thank you. Hey, right. call in your order now because she will cut it off. It is Whistle Stop right there in Unicoi. You can also find her on Facebook. There is that phone number. She'll be glad to make your Thanksgiving very special.